Hey guys, thanks for tuning in today. Um, we are gonna be starting off my channel with this brand new solar shed that I have out behind my yard. And I'm just so excited to share this with you guys. I've been watching a couple YouTube um, channels just on solar energy and we'll feature those in the descriptions and comments. And so be sure to subscribe. But um, I'm gonna be going over everything that we've got inside this shed, uh, outside and inside, and just show you how I've built this. Um, I've learned a lot over the last couple months and I hope to just show you those things so that you can do a project very similar to, to this yourself. So let's take a look inside. Well, as it turns out, it is a very cloudy Arizona day. These are rare, but that's not gonna stop us from doing the video of the solar shed. So here is the outside of it. It is a 10 by 10, or I'm sorry, a 10 by 12 shed that I had a gentleman make for me. And uh, on the top, we'll go over some of these things uh, here. The, the whole goal is to just show you guys everything that I've done, but I've got two 335 watt Panasonic panels up on the top. A little weather system with a security camera on there. So that's kind of the outside. I don't want to get into too many details. I just want to show you guys what's in this thing. And then in my other videos, we are going to be going over all of the equipment that you see inside here and how I built this solar set shed. So there is the system and you might be able to see we've got some Victron units and I've got some bus bars and I've got some circuit breakers and some switches down here. I've got two Battleborn batteries, uh, an old laptop that I'm using the Victron Connect, and uh, there's my inverter. Uh, you just saw a moment ago outside the weather system, and so here's the monitoring system for that. This guy, I can't wait to talk to you guys about that. Um, so I'm just gonna leave that kind of as a surprise. And it's all hooked up, and my goal here is to have everything in this shed completely powered off the grid. Now, I do have grid tie in, well, I should say, I do have power to the shed from the grid, but I am not using it at the moment. Everything is being done off of the solar power that I'm generating, and look at this, guys, with two, with two 335 watts, because of how cloudy it is outside, um, I'm only getting 15 watts coming in off those panels right now. So <laughs> it's pretty funny, but man, on a sunny day, I'm getting over five, 500 watts coming in off those guys. So I look forward to showing you all of these things, how I put it together, how it works. So you're going to want to subscribe to the channel. You're going to want to stick around and we're going to have a lot of fun with this solar shed. Thanks. We'll talk soon.